Yeah, I was in Canada recently where the air's a little colder, the beer's a little crisper, and the people are a little denser. And uh, I was uh, going to this, uh, I went to see this hockey game, a minor league hockey team, uh, this horrible team called the Montreal, the Toronto Ineps, horrible team, pot bellies, over 40, rust skates. They're playing this first place team called the Montreal Invincibles. These guys were incredible, never lost a game all year. But the thing that made this game so memorable was for the Toronto team, an 85-year-old goalie came out of retirement to play for them. Now his name was the Gamper, and he was the last goalie in the National Hockey League not to wear a mask. And they can understand what he looked like, but he, he found out he, uh, he didn't have much time left to live. He, he, he asked the Toronto team if he could play one last game. They said, sure, because they were having trouble getting anybody to stand in the crease. And uh, this is what happened. The game went into three overtime periods with no score. Now, you've got to understand, after three overtimes with no score, everybody wants to go home. The fans, the players, the referees, the Zamboni machine had run out of gas, the tires were bald. We want to get out of here. So this is how the referees finally got the game to end. This is the fourth overtime period with the Gamper in goal. Here at home tonight with the star of the game so far is Linda Gamper. He's made 875 saves. It's an NHL record. We're just about ready now. The referees are at center ice. They're getting ready to drop the puck. I see that the Toronto team has not even come out yet. It's the Montreal team's ready. And the Gamper's in goal as he has been the whole game. But the Toronto team has still not come out of the dressing room. So the referees drop the puck anyway. Take him out of the Montreal team. Shot saved by the Gamper. Shot saved by the Gamper. Rebound saved by the Gamper again. Shot saved by the Gamper. And he kicks the puck out of the zone. He's got no help out there whatsoever. And now I see Toronto is starting to come out of the dressing room. I think they're having a little trouble walking. Maybe they've been drinking. They're having a little trouble getting over those boards as Montreal brings another rush into the zone. Shot saved by the Gamper. Shot saved by the Gamper. Shot saved. Saved by the Gamper. He kicks the puck out of the zone as the Toronto team crawls onto the ice now. And I see the Toronto team is huddling. Are they going to help their goalie? Uh, no, they're going to try and block his view. They're standing in front of the net trying to let that puck slip by him. Shot saved by the Gamper. Shot saved by the Gamper. How can he do it? I don't know. Shot saved again. And he kicks the puck out of the zone. I see the Toronto team is skating now with the Montreal team. They're talking about something. Montreal's bringing the puck into the zone now. They pass to the one of the Toronto players. Shot saved by the Gamper. His own team is trying to score on him. There's 10 players on they're shooting that puck at the Gamper. Shot save. And I see two of the Toronto players are trying to knock the Gamper down with their sticks, but he's standing there in the crease. There's another shot and a save again by the Gamper. And now the referees are lowering a second net onto the ice and putting next to the first one. There's two nets on their side by side. The puck goes either one of those two nets. It's a goal. Shot save by the Gamper. Shot save again. Shot save. There's an obstacle. Leg save. Back of the head save. Well, that stunned them. And now I see they're lowering two more nets down from the ceiling. There's four nets out there. The puck goes either one of those four nets. It's a goal. Shot save by the Gamper. Save by the Gamper. Save. The puck splits in half with the referee save. Go ahead and play with it. Shot save by the Gamper. Again. And now the referees are letting both teams come out onto the ice and score on the Gamper. There's 40 players out there shooting that puck at him. Shot saved by the Gamper. Shot saved by the Gamper. Even the referees are throwing the puck at him. Shot saved by the Gamper. Again, he kicks the puck out of the zone. And now see the referees are bringing out three basket loads of pucks. There's 100 pucks in each basket. If any of those pucks goes past the Gamper, it's a goal. Shot saved by the Gamper. Shot saved. Save, save. I can't even say save every save he's making. I'll just say save every 10 times. 10 times. Save, save, save. Save, 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 save. The shot scores! No one hit the post and bounced out. It never did go in, ladies and gentlemen. I can't believe it. And now the referees are saying it's a $100,000 reward for anybody who gets a puck by the Gamper. And all the fans are getting sticks and pucks. It's sticking puck day here at the arena. These people are rabid. Some of them are so stupid to use the wrong end of the stick. Shot saved by the Gamper. Saved by the Gamper again. And now the referees say if anybody gets anything past the Gamper, it's a goal. Here comes a guy with a rifle trying to get a bullet by him. Oh, great face saved by the Gamper. It stunned him. And now, ladies and gentlemen, here comes a guy with a javelin trying to get a javelin by him. Oh, great chest save by the Gamper. No rebound on that javelin. And now here's the meteor coming to the roof in three seconds. Oh, great meteor saved by the Gamper. His pads are on fire, but he's standing in that crease. And wait a minute. I see the roof of the arena is opening up. And there's God. He's got a lightning bolt in his hand. I guess he wants that $100,000 so that uh, Jimmy Swagger can get his ministry going again. Let's see if God can get this lightning bolt by him. No! The camper makes a great lightning bolt save! Unfortunately, there's nothing left but a pair of red-hot skates in the crease, and everybody's now scoring it well. Thanks a lot, folks. You've been great.